in Jamestown, New York, which I'm sure you're thinking, Allie, why are you there? But here's the deal. Lucille Ball grew up here and there's a museum here now. So I'm a little excited. There's like two parts to the museum. Apparently one is more about like Lucy and Desi and their television studio and her childhood. And then the other section is just, I love Lucy, which if you haven't seen it, I don't know what you're doing, but download it ASAP. It's one of the like most classic comedy shows you can watch. She and her husband changed the game when it came to the studio system. So super, super excited. I'm gonna go into the museum. We're gonna check it out and hopefully it lives up to how much I'm hyping it up right now. So I just left the museum. It is amazing. It is like the coolest thing ever. If you're into the history of film and television at all, or if you grew up like I did watching I Love Lucy, this is a place you've got to go. It's just, it's next level. I was so blown away by how well done it was. I do think they could have probably had more artifacts, but given how long ago a lot of this took place and the fact that 
back in the day, studio systems didn't really save everything. I think it's pretty impressive the amount of stuff they do have available to see. Highly, highly recommend it. I'll put the information in the link below for you. Go see it. Especially if you're an I Love Lucy fan, you're not going to be disappointed. And if you still don't know who Lucy is after watching this, I'm going to go ahead and also put a link to one of my favorite podcast episodes that talks all about her history with the studio system and her life. And it's just, it's next level. So check it out and I will see you in the next video. Please like and subscribe for more.